So right now we're looking at a bunch of results and uh, they're ranked upon popularity as far as sales go. So if we're looking through here and we see that a lot of these really don't relate to what we're looking for. So what we could do is narrow it down by choosing a category. So if I choose category here and since it deals with employment and lucky me I found a money and employment category. So that's great. So we can go ahead and click on go and most likely it's going to narrow it a little further down. If it hasn't narrowed it down, you can narrow it even further by choosing a subcategory. And sometimes we can choose this jobs here and most likely it's going to give us a better results. So I've scrolled down to number nine here. It says the ultimate guide to job interview answers. It talks about uh, the best job interview guide on the net and that sounds good. So uh, that's the first thing. We found a product. Uh, remember the second step was to look at the statistics. So let me show you what the statistics mean. Basically what this means is earn per sale. What you earn for every sale. So you get $12.88 for each sale. And if we move over a little bit, you can see it gives us 50% commission. And referral rate is 30%. So about 30% of the affiliates, uh, that's where the sales come from. And you have gravity here, which is 18.57. So let's just say that we want to go ahead and promote this specific product. So before you do that, you want to view the pitch page which is basically the sales page, which was the third step, was to go to the sales web page and act like a customer. So you don't want to see this from a vendor view. You want to see this from the perspective of a customer. Let's just get in the mode, let's say that we're going to a job interview and we're, we need advice on how to have a good job interview. So let's go ahead and go to that sales page here and see if it's something that we want to actually promote. So the first thing you want to look at is the headline. We see here it says job interview, how to answer any question an interviewer could possibly throw at you. So that's a pretty bold claim, but it's very interesting and it has me hooked because if I can answer any question an interviewer could possibly throw at me, I could be pretty much set. So if I go down, it says, arm yourself with proven behavioral interview answers. And we know psychologically and behavioral interview answers can be some, some of the hardest things for us. But we can, if we have the answers to those and we have templates, access to templates, then that's a big selling point right there. So if we scroll down a little bit, we can see here that we can see the product details and we see testimonials. Testimonials are things that sell. So we can read Sarah Bronstein's testimonial about this product itself. We scroll down a little bit, it talks about the product and the guide. And it gives us a little bit of a taste by giving us tricky questions that it'll be answering in the future, which is good. So I can already see without looking even halfway down that this is going to be a good sales letter. So now that I have read the sales letter, I say, okay, well, I want to promote this. How do I do it? The fourth step you want to do is you want to create a hop link. So as you can see here, you have the create hop link link here. Click on that and you're going to enter your ClickBank nickname. So you can enter that here. Click on submit. And you can go ahead and copy this to your web page. You can copy this, which is the direct link, or you can cut and copy this, which basically people will see links that say click here. And you can change whatever's in the click here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the articles, that article that we were editing earlier, and we can say something like, if you would like more tips, go to this link and more click here and if you want to find other profitable affiliate programs you can also do so 
by searching through the results that ClickBank is giving us. And we see another one that pays $17.52. Their gravity is 5.87. So it's up to you to choose them. You can search this one just to see what it looks like. Interview downloads. Now th this is a good example of sales letter that may not necessarily pull you in or as a customer because it doesn't really have a headline and it doesn't really have much information. To me it looks more like a website that was just put up in a few minutes and I would not, I most likely would not promote that product just because of that because you want products to promote on your you know article that will actually convert. Now lastly I want to talk about selling points. Uh, when you're writing stuff like click here now uh, one thing you can remember is that if you want to find out the selling points of that product you can always go and read the description here. So if you want to change the click here to something else like you know work less than two hours a day and earn 1500 a week you know blah 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 join this program it says join the best affiliate program here but you can change the words around to meet your needs basically so great now you know how to find profitable affiliate programs using that three-step process find the product look at the statistics and going to the sales page so you can see it for yourself now you know how to do all of that you can do it over and over again in the future now in the next video I'm going to talk about creating a resource box. Basically what a resource box is it's going to be down here. It's going to talk about you. It's going to be basically a biography, a short biography that talks about you, your name, your website address, you know, your elevator pitch, call to action and things like that. Whether you're you're going to offer a free report, sell affiliate programs or build your own